Hello everybody, my name is Monty, and this is Nogu Gaming, and today, you may recognize this course we are on. Ah yes, it is time to start a new destruction series, which is not a new concept, but it is driven till destruction, and we are on the Proving Grounds. So if you watched Fail Race's uh, playthrough of this, what he did is he took cars pretty much as fast as they could around this course and see how long they could survive for. So that is pretty much exactly what I'm going to do with not many changes, but maybe a couple. One of the big changes I'm going to do for this series, just to not be like a copy, is to change the name of the various things and run different vehicles and such. So give me your suggestions for names of stuff you would like to see. Like, obviously, this is going to be the spinners. But this? What would you call this? The speed bumps? Generally speaking, some of these names might just be shoehorned in because that's the fitting name for them. But all in all, this will be a very similarly styled series to the one that I have done in the past, which is Escape the Cops, except the only difference is we're not escaping cops. We're just surviving as long as we possibly can. So we've got a lot of track to cover, and we'll see how far this ETK, oh, that's too far, we'll see how far this ETK can go. Ah yes, we are starting the ETK. That's like our starting point for most of these series. So. Now that um, Driven Till Destruction, Escape the Cops in Utah has ended, I'll switch to this, and then after this one ends, I'll go back to an Escape the Cops sort of variant. Just a little bit of content creativity, I suppose, or content... Ah, what's the word? Essentially, different stuff to look at, so it's not just the same old, same old. So, how long is this ETK going to survive for? One of the things that I am keeping from Alex's playthrough is I need to push these cars hard. Because if I just go super slow with them, that's not going to do anything, ever. So we're going to go pretty forceful with this. But still, just generally be careful on some places so we don't, like, overshoot or hit the wall. The crawler rule will be in effect for this. And that is missing its textures, but that's fine. I think that's the only thing that's missing from the Proving Grounds you know and love. So, our bumper was causing issues for a little bit, but we're fine. It's been ripped off over the speed bumps. And I'm gonna take this hard. Be gentle though. Because I don't want to break important bits. Alright. Gotta weave between the spinners so if we get hit by those. This car is low enough it might be fine. But it's gonna hurt. So we come into this section, and that actually kind of reminds me of the S's and, um, oh, I turned the car off, oopsie, there we go, that was a hard crunch, but it looks like we're fine, so we're going to keep going. That switch back back there kind of reminds me of the, the way the S's work in, um, Watkins Glen. So this, and Alex's series, was called Dover. 
Oh, and there goes the radiator. That's a problem. Now we are on a time constraint. This ETK will die fast. Oh, I don't like the twisting. Please stay in a brief straight angle. Oof. Heart hits everywhere. The boots come unleashed. And that is a lap. And we have crashed. So, for the most part, this is not going to be very much different than what you would see on his channel. But, I have a high respect for Alex and his crew, so I wouldn't completely copy everything. Because this is such a wonderful idea. Just cut cars and see how far they can go. Through the water. Pretty good and clean. Of the speed bumps. Up to two miles. And I will node grabber if a vehicle flips over. And as I was saying, um, ooh, that's so rough. Is that that <laughs> back right is uh, cambered at a funny angle? That's probably not good. But as I was saying, there will be the crawler rule. So like, if I'm just trundling about at like. 25 miles per hour and the car can do no faster than that it might be counted out otherwise it will just never achieve any damage oh ooh, a big twitch oh a hard hit look good this is about halfway through lap two and we definitely don't drive straight anymore Gonna drift around there. Ooh, bonk into the wall. That's probably not gonna help. Gonna dive off the cliff. That's what I'm gonna call that. That's the cliff. It, I mean, it is a cliff. It just gotta be careful because you'll lose the radiator or various other important bits, and you don't want to do that. Ah. How oh, they went steering. For the right. We still got steering. It's enough to keep going. But it's a barely just enough. Uh oh. Turn. That's that's it. Oh, it's dead. It has absolutely no steering input at all. <laughs> well, it's got life, it just don't got steering. That is the ETK dead. 3.2 miles and it just barely misses out on three laps. Good effort, but that's a pretty low benchmark. On to the next people. Up next, we have got a Bruckle horsepower. It is basically a Mustang. So it ought to be interesting what this can do. It's a five point oh liter. Ooh, and there. Turn it back on. Ooh, that's got some noise to it. So we're going to take this and see what it can do. The Mustang. Here we go. That's very loud. Very loud. Aggressive jump. <laughs> it doesn't have a 
It doesn't have a texture for broken glass, but that's fine. It's not a big deal. Oof. That's rough. That's rough. I think it pulls now. That's a problem. Hmm. It would come up to the spinners. We're good. What is that engine sound? Is that the... Barstow? I don't know. It's very loud. Another big twitch. Land that one fine. As fine as fine can be. It does not sound happy. We are good. It does pull well. That's a problem. Over the cliff. Surprised the radiator hasn't gone. Oof. And we've rolled our Mustang. Or kind of. There we go. Over those rough dirt jumps. Penultimate jump. And final jump. Ooh, heavy hit. Oh, it pulls to the opposite way now. It does not like that. Ooh, over the tabletops. We're good and gone. Good and gone. No steering input. Look how much it pulls. That's a bad sign. Here we go. Oh, the speed bumps. Is that- are those really speed bumps? No. They're more like... Uh... I don't know what you would call those. Those are the aggressive speed bumps. Into the spinners we go. Ooh, turn. That's gonna create a problem if we can't turn going in there. Constantly lifting up the front wheels and bottoming out. Oh, oh, oh. Point in a straight direction, please. That was a nice landing. As nice as nice can be. Is it gonna go farther than the ETK? Uh oh. Oh, steering. Steering to the right has gone. That's a problem. That's a big problem. I cannot hardly steer when it decides to go a certain way. Ah, oh, this is painful. Over the cliff. Maybe that knocked out the steering. Yes, it did. I think. It knocked out steering or drive to that wheel. I think. Maybe. So now it doesn't fight against the car. Use speed. Just go. Of 
break rating. That's not good. Uh oh. Turn. 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 I said turn. We're gonna make it to a third lap. Turn. Oh, that's horrible. Horrible. Ah. Uh, the speed bumps is just terrible. That is barely making any speed over the tabletops. Turn. That deflated the tire. I don't think that's helping though. Oh, it's very low. This is going to be a big problem up here. Yeah, big problem. Somehow still making it. I think we're about to see a spinner death. If we can even get that far. Turn. The aggressive speed bumps. I think that's what I'm going to name that. Oh, somehow it makes that. Oh, it hates this section. Use some speed. Uh oh. Yep, that's steering dead. Ah, oh, well, the Mustang. It's gonna get further, but it's dead. Tough break. Just a, a scruffy run over the jump, and that was that. Yeah. When you don't take this at speed, it seems to do much more damage. And at 40 miles per hour is not fast enough to avoid some serious damage. Well, that's it for the Bracco horsepower, which is essentially. A Mustang. On to the third and final vehicle. And finally, we have got an H series. It's big, it's top heavy, it's not really that slow through testing. So we'll see how this vehicle can do. You ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Interesting. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna have to keep it in D, I guess. And drive. Over the speed bumps. Here come the tabletops for the first time. Ooh, it's very bouncy. It's very big, so the spinners are gonna be fine. Here we go. Through the water. Yeah, I guess that's the checkerboard. 
I'll keep that name. I like that name. Here we come to the aggressive speed bumps. It's gonna flip. It's fairly composed over that. Here we go. Spinners number one. Oh, I lost a wing mirror. That's lame. And a rear windshield. Rear window. Is it a, a rear windshield? Here we go to the big jump. Ooh, a big clunk. But it's fine. How far is this big old wing gonna go? A lot of bits and pieces of it are broken now. Ooh, almost rolled it. Here we come off the cliff. Ouch. A big old clunk. Oh, there goes my bumper. Big clunk. Another one. Use some speed. Use some speed. Here we come to the penultimate. Here we go. Made that pretty cleanly. Uh oh. Oh, we're good. And that is lap one complete. On to lap two. I don't like how much the engine is shaking. Oh, that was a oh, big mistake. Yeah, we rolled our van. Kind of. That's just kind of turtling. Now grab it and keep going. What's it stuck on? Oh, it's stuck on a tree. I saw that right front wheel being at a funky angle, but it looks like it's st ooh, it pulls heavily to the right. That is bad. That's bad. This is very bad. Oh man. This might cause a problem with the spinners. Oof. Hard clunks over the aggressive speed bumps. Oh, man. Uh-oh. There's no way to get out of this. Oh, man. But still alive? Yeah, it's not going to be able to go back over there. That, oh my gosh, that has eaten the spinners. It's still going though. <laughs> Three wheel van, and it keeps going. Oh, the radiator's gone. That's gonna be a problem. But I think we have bigger problems at the moment. Uh oh. Like that. Yeah, it's dead. <laughs> Absolutely no steering whatsoever for the van. The axles have failed. Oh my gosh. Look at, just look at that. And it's gonna slide down here. And that's its final resting place. Look how bad.
bad that is. Oh my gosh. That's going to do it for the van. Took a mighty whack in spinners, and once that happened, that was kind of it. Well, that's going to do it, folks. I hope you enjoyed this episode of The Proving Grounds and Driven to Destruction. Thanks to, uh, Alex or Failways for this idea and definitely send me some comments on vehicles you would like to see run around this fantastic course. Until next time, I'm Monty and this is Market Gaming and I'll see you in the next one. Hey y'all, thank you so much for watching. Send me a like or a sub if you enjoyed this content. You can also find me on Discord at Narcus Empire, and there's a link there, and TikTok at Money Creates. I really hope you enjoyed this content, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.